Hey guys, welcome to the next episode. Today I'm going to show you how to use Hop Exchange. But before we begin, remember that in the description of this video you will find a link to our Telegram group, so make sure to join us. And now let's start. First of all, we need to go to hop.exchange website. Once you get here, click on the Use Hop button at the center and you will be taken to the app.hop.exchange website. And why did I decide to create a video about Hop Exchange today? First of all, this is very useful exchange to transfer uh, crypto, mostly stable coins like USDT, USDC, and DAI, but also Matic and Ethereum between different chains. So over here, uh, we can transfer crypto between Ethereum mainnet, Polygon, XDAI, Optimism, and Arbitrum. And it's quite cheap, so I believe all of you will love it. The second reason is because Hop Exchange doesn't have a token yet. So I believe that there is a high chance in the future early users of Hop Exchange may get some airdrop. There is a chance of that, but besides that, it's amazing uh, protocol. So I hope you will find it very useful. So now uh, let's start. First of all, we need to connect our MetaMask and then swap to the network from which we would like to send the tokens. So let me change the network to Arbitrum because I have some Ethereum on Arbitrum at the moment. And then over here we need to select the network from which we would like to send and the token that we would like to send. So I'm going to choose Ethereum here. And then down below we choose to which network we would like to send. So I'm going to send from Arbitrum to Polygon. And then on Polygon there is no Ethereum, there is only wrapped Ethereum. So it will be transferred from Ethereum on Arbitrum to wrapped Ethereum on Polygon. So let's just type in above over here how much Ethereum are we going to transfer. So I'm going to type 0.03. And then down below it should show that I will get 0.02998 uh, wrapped Ethereum. As you can see the fees of the bridge are very very small. So it's just uh, 0.00006.11. And then at the bottom we have approve and send buttons. Uh, I already approved Ethereum before because I used this protocol before. So if you didn't, you'll have to do it uh, right now. And then once it's approved, you click on send. And then confirm by clicking send button. Once you do this, MetaMask should pop up. And over here, you need to simply confirm the transaction. Uh, once you do this, the transaction will take a few minutes to be confirmed. And then after a few minutes, uh, as you can see, it's already completed. And as you can see on Polygon, I already have 0 0.0299 wrapped Ethereum. So that's how easily you can transfer it between uh, different chains. So now maybe let's uh, swap it and I'm going to send from Polygon to Optimism. So I'm going to send the maximum balance from Polygon. And then I will receive uh, 0 0.0. 0.299 Ethereum on Optimism. So as you can see over here, I need to approve it now. So I hit on approve. And since I was working on Arbitrum before, I need to switch the network. Because we're sending from Polygon, it shows me that I need to switch to Matic, so just click switch. And once we do this, we can hit approve. Uh, once we do this, MetaMask window will pop up and we need to confirm the approval transaction. And once the transaction is confirmed, the send button is activated. So let's just click on it. Let's click send. And then let's confirm this transaction in MetaMask. And after 128 confirmations, our transaction should be already confirmed and we will receive our Ethereum on Optimism. As you can see, it's already confirmed. Let's close it. And as you can see on Optimism, I already received this uh, 0.03 uh, Ethereum. So now let me show you another thing, which is Convert. Uh, convert allows us to convert, for example, wrapped Ethereum to H Ethereum, Hop Ethereum. And over here, we can uh, convert Ethereum, DAI, Matic, USDT, USDC to HUSDT, HUSDC, and so on and so on from different chains. So 
Of course, you don't have to convert Ethereum, but in this example, I'm going to convert Ethereum. And why do we need it? We need it to provide liquidity. So the next step I'm going to show you is adding liquidity. Right now, let's first convert Ethereum. So I'm just going to choose Optimism. I'm going to choose Ethereum. So first of all, as you can see, we need to convert wrapped Ethereum. I don't have any wrapped Ethereum. So click over here and then choose the amount of Ethereum you would like to wrap. I'm just going to type 0.03 and then click wrap. Confirm the transaction in MetaMask. And as soon as we do this, as you can see, I have 0.03 wrapped Ethereum. Now, once we have it, we can uh, collapse this uh, window over here and then type in the amount of wrapped Ethereum that we want to convert to H Ethereum. So I'm just going to type the half of the amount that I have, which is 0.015. And as you can see, I will receive 0.049 H Ethereum. So just click approve, approve the transaction in MetaMask. Once the transaction is approved, the convert button should become activated. And as you can see, it's activated now. So click on it, click convert, and then confirm the transaction in MetaMask. Uh, once you do this, you should see that you already have H Ethereum or any other token that you chose over here. So now let's go to pool and I'm going to show you the last part, which is adding liquidity. In order to add liquidity over here, you need to choose on which network you want to add liquidity. So I'm just going to choose Optimism and which token. So I'm going to choose Ethereum. And then over here, type the amount for wrapped Ethereum and H Ethereum that you would like to provide. So I'm just going to hit max and go to add liquidity. Approve the transaction, uh, confirm the transaction in MetaMask. Once the approval transaction is confirmed, click on add liquidity. So you will have a summary over here. So click add liquidity. MetaMask window will pop up. And over here, you need to confirm the transaction in MetaMask. And as soon as you do this, once the transaction is confirmed, uh, you can see over here the summary of your liquidity position. So as you can see, I'm providing liquidity from for wrapped Ethereum slash H Ethereum. The amount is 0 0.02984. Uh, what is the percentage of pool share of my position and so on and so on. So all the details are here. And this is how you can add liquidity to Hop Exchange. And if you would like to withdraw your liquidity, you can find the button at the bottom of the page. As you can see, there is remove liquidity. So you can simply click over there and withdraw your liquidity position. And that's it for today. Please let me know in the comments if you managed to send crypto between different chains, if you managed to add liquidity to Hop Exchange. And remember to hit thumbs up, subscribe our channel and share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching.